Today's social media segment is brought to you by South Louisiana Bank. It's better when we bank together. Weights and Downer, attorneys at law. Terrebonne Ford, built Ford Tough. Welcome back to this edition of Bayou Time. Again, your host, Keith Weissheit, licensed clinical social worker with Tara Bourne Home Care. Very glad you're joining us. However you may be joining us, we appreciate it. And you know, it's during the summer that we get some unique things happening in our community. One of those is when we get to celebrate with kids being able to put on productions. This is one of those times. And so we're very, very glad to welcome in the cast of The Little Mermaid. Uh, thank you, ladies, for joining us. We appreciate that. First, we have Miss Iris Hunter. Thank you, Iris. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. You're very, very welcome. Next, we have the Emmas. We'll start with <laughs> Emma Thibodeau. Hello, Miss Emma Thibodeau, uh, starring as Ursula. Thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. You're very welcome. And then we have Miss Emma Acosta. Miss Emma, thanks for joining us. Thank you for having me. You're very, very welcome. Of course, she will be Prince Eric. <laughs> So, all right. Um, so, Ms. Iris, tell us a little bit about you. I want people to get to know who you are and why it is that you came to be able to do this. Okay. Well, I'm 13 years old. Okay. And I started solo when I was really young, when I was like seven years old. Oh, my. This is like my 11th play with solo. So 11 years. plays yeah. in six years, half of mm -hmm. your life. Pretty much. Oh, okay. Very cool. So, it's been really fun. I've done it for a long time. And I'm going to Vanderbilt Catholic High School. And I'm part of the dance team there. I do, obviously, I do this. I do mm -hmm. this a lot. This is like my main activity. Right. So I do this. And yeah, this is pretty much That's all it. that I do. Yeah. So what is it that got you wanting to do theater? What is it that got you wanting to do solo? Well, I feel like, I don't know. I really like the idea of performing. Mm -hmm. It's just really fun to me. So when I started doing this when I was younger, I was like, whoa, this, this is fun. Yeah. So I just kept doing it and it stuck. So that, that little bug that, that bit you when you got on stage and people started clapping, you're like, I can do this. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, Miss Emma, how about you? Well, first and foremost, we did a test earlier. Tell everybody what SOLA means. <laughs> SOLA means South Louisiana Center for the Arts. Okay. And it, yeah. All right. Very cool. So let's uh, get your story a little bit, Miss Emma. Well, I'm 13 years old and I go to Homa Christian School. Okay. Um, I've done theater for so many years. This is probably my 12th solo show. Wow. And um, I'm on the cross country team. I like to run. I like to sing. I like to act. And um, yeah. Wow. That's pretty much it. Triple threat. I like it. Very good. Well, look, you know, being able to run, enjoying that, singing, acting, all of those things. That's just really, really cool. Well, thanks for joining us today. And uh, that history uh, obviously will give you the opportunity to play the very mean Ursa, right? Yes. Yeah. Is that is that good acting for you or is yes, that kind of real? I'm just good kidding. Answer. There you go. That's a, good, that's a really good answer. Really good answer. All right, Emma, number two. Hi, Um, I'm 15 years old. Okay. And I, this is my eighth play with solo. Oh, cool. And sorry. So when, that's okay. When did, when did you kind of know you wanted to do this, do these kinds of things? Like you've been doing solo for a little while now, yes, right? Sir. So it's fun for the summer, right? But y'all do stuff all year long, right? Oh yeah. Okay. So obviously y'all do quite a few plays. Y'all do mm -hmm. some at different times. Uh, and so what was it about this particular play? Were you excited about this one? I am very excited about this play. Okay. Tell me why. Um, well, this is my f first time playing an actual guy role. Okay. And it's actually really exciting for me. Very cool. Very cool. I like that. Uh, and so sometimes that's one of those things, right? When we get out of our comfort zone a little bit and we get to truly be somebody different, you get to be somebody different and kind of a different gender too. So that's really, really cool. I got to do that years ago. And so that was really, really fun for me to play something very different than who I was. So let's talk about the show. So the show's coming up, right? We're talking uh, July 19th through 21st, very, very soon. Yes. And so yes. there's a great flyer there. Thank you, Jason. Uh, it's Disney's The Little Mermaid. Made. It'll be Friday, July 19th at 7 p.m., Saturday, July 20th at 7 p.m., and Sunday, July 21st at 2 p.m. <laughs> Tickets very, very cheap, $10 and $15 at Terrebonne High School. Uh, you don't want to miss this play. It is going to be really, really fun. And I misspoke. It is The Little Mermaid 
Jr., <laughs> uh, which is really cool. Yes. All right, so Ariel, what's it like to be Ariel? Well, it, this is my first like lead role in a play, so right. it's been very fun. Okay. Her personality is really like bubbly and fun, which is a lot like myself. So okay. it's kind of easy to play it, but okay. it's also really fun just to like really get in the details. Well, it's very clear to me when all of you guys came in that y'all have a great deal of fun not only doing this but y'all enjoy being around each other yeah. as well uh if i could have offered for all of you guys just to huddle up and be all up here together <laughs> y'all would have done that i know uh so that's really really cool yeah. all right let's talk about playing ursula miss emma so playing ursula it's very 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 hard because um she's very mean yep. and she really she's sassy she's a queen she doesn't like wait on anyone you know she goes at her own time you know and she she's very like high and low and she'll switch from mean to you know um sinister and nice and you know she'll she has different emotions and it's very hard ursula's all over the place <laughs> she's all over the place yeah, ursula's like the mean diva right <laughs> yes okay and that's kind of not like you right no <laughs> <laughs> well uh we look forward to seeing how uh, ursula comes off uh how emma does ursula and so we've talked a lot about your role and what's exciting right about being prince eric uh this is going to be a great play and so mm -hmm. i want people to be able to go out and do that so jay put the flower up one more time i want you to know you can go out and see them the little mermaid jr friday at seven o'clock on july 19th saturday july 20th at seven saturday uh, sunday is a matinee on july 21st only 10 and 15 dollars uh, for kids and for adults and again at terrible high school the little mermaid jr so very glad to have prince eric and ursula and uh the the star miss uh, ariel here with us so uh thank y'all for coming on to talk with us a little bit about it we appreciate yeah. that congratulations to sola for all of the great programs that they put forth but also all the great kids that they have over thank, at thank you so much right, thank, thank you, you. Thank you. all right guys us. you're welcome that'll do it for this particular segment but don't go anywhere a whole lot more right here on bayou time When you have a history of greatness, the real challenge starts after the finish line. When victory alone isn't enough, you chase something greater, no matter how difficult the path, on the dirt, in the sand, and beyond. The new 2024 Ridgeline Passport and Pilot, part of our most rugged trail sport lineup yet. From Honda. Hello and welcome back to this edition of Bayou Time. I'm your host, Keith Weissite, licensed clinical social worker with Terraborn Home Care. Very glad you're joining us. However, you may be joining us, we appreciate it. And I'm very, very glad to have joining me the rest of the cast from The Little Mermaid Junior. And so we're very, very glad to have y'all. First, we have Miss Danielle Freeman. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you for having me. All right, and playing Sebastian, is yes, that right? Sir. Very cool. Sitting next to her is Miss Emma Sanji. Hi, Miss Emma. Hi. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Thank you very much. Of course, she's playing Scuttle, and she's one of the three Emmas that you've seen today, but there's even more. There's five Emmas, yep. which is awesome. So we got to figure out how y'all differentiate each other there at Sola. Yeah. And lastly, uh, we're very glad to, glad to have Miss Lark Blanchard. Thanks for joining us, Miss Lark. Thank you for having me. All right, very good. And Lark is playing one of everybody's favorite character, Flounder. Very cool. So we'll start with you, Miss Danielle. Tell us a little bit about you and a little bit about your enjoyment with uh, Sola. I am 13 years old. I attend Homa Junior High. Okay. And I've been doing Sola for a good minute. Um, this is my sixth Sola play and eighth in general. Okay. Um, I love doing Sola. Like, this, these are my people. Like, mm -hmm. I enjoy it so much. And, like, the adrenaline rush that you get on stage when you're singing and everybody starts clapping, like, it's, like, unmatchable. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, um, it's wonderful. Wonderful. And I, this is my first lead role and Sebastian's such a cool guy and he's so enjoyable to play. And I love working with all my friends. Like they may, like I, if I did not have these good friends that I have here, I would probably not be doing this again, Right. you know, but 
it's solo is just such a wonderful experience like all around and everybody's so positive and it's just awesome well we have sola and we have the emma experience yeah. right <laughs> so it's the the fans of all of these emmas mm -hmm. which is very very nice and so miss emma sorge very glad to have you uh so tell us a little bit about you and a little bit about how much you like doing stuff with sola i'm 13 i go to saint francis okay i really like sola because like all the, like, the people are like really nice. Like, I feel like, I don't know. It's just like all the people are so nice and. Mm -hmm. It's nice to hang out with nice people, right? Yeah. Yeah, they make you a better person when we're around nice people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and so listen, there's so much negativity all around all the time. It's nice to kind of be able to hang out, especially during the summer, right? Right, yeah. That's what we want our summer to be, Yeah. right? We want our summer to be cool. Yeah. 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 And, and rarely can you be as cool as, as hanging out with somebody like Flounder, right? <laughs> so, Lark, tell me a little bit about you. I'm 12 years old, and I go to St. Francis. I've been doing Sola since I was seven years old. I think this is my 10th wow. play with them. Wow. You know what's really interesting? You sound like Flounder. <laughs> right? Yeah, definitely. Don't you really? Do you think that? <laughs> sort of. Flounder's just the coolest, but you sound like Flounder. <laughs> like, and everybody wants to be around Flounder. Everybody wants to hang out with Flounder. But you guys together, it was interesting when y'all introduced yourselves. You were like, oh, yeah, we'll come on together because we all bow together. Yeah. Okay, tell me what that means. So um, they wanted, like, obviously not every individual person can bow by themselves for time re timing reasons. Right. But, like, we are always, like, hanging out together. We're always trying to help Ariel out, make have her make the best decisions. And then we just, like, bow together at the end. And because, you know, we're... Scuttle, Flounder, and Sebastian. <laughs> you just, that's kind of who you are, right? Yeah. So interestingly enough, y'all get to do in a play what I do in real life. Mm -hmm. My job is to help people and support them. You guys are helping Ariel. Y'all yeah. are trying to help her make good decisions. Yeah. That's just so very cool. Yeah. yeah. I like that. And I really like the fact that you guys are able to do this and enjoy it. Y'all have multiple uh, plays that y'all put on. Mm -hmm. But let's let the public know. Jason, put that flyer up and let people know. You can come out and see them. This is the cast of the Little Mermaid Jr. joining us today, and they will be uh, live on stage Friday, July 19th at 7 p.m., Saturday, July 20th at 7 p.m., and the Sunday matinee, July 21st at 2 p.m. at Terrebonne High School. Very, very cheap tickets. You certainly want to come out and see this. And you want to see all of the wonderful support team that Ariel has so that you can come out and support Sola and help them. They do so many things in the community, but making a difference for these young people and what they do and introducing them to the arts is one of the biggest things. And so we're really, really thankful. So let's talk about how tryouts went. Did y'all like have an idea of what you wanted to do or be? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, for me personally, like I, every, I've always loved The Little Mermaid and Sebastian was always one of my favorite characters. He's such a cool guy. And um, I knew that I wanted to play him. So I was preparing like as soon as the packets came out because right. they give us a lot of time to prepare. Okay. So as soon as they came out, like I instantly started practicing a lot. Like I practiced with my friends, like we ran lines together and um, and auditions weren't even that stressful. Like because they make, awesome. they make you feel very comfortable. They give you all the time in the world. And if you need to run it again, you can run it again. You wow. know, very good. Emma, how about Scuttle for you? Scuttle is like a very fun role. So I knew like I was like, like, uh, <laughs> you were interested in doing Scuttle, right? Yes. And like, guy. yeah. And like before auditions, like we had like, we played like a bunch of icebreakers and stuff. So like, it was oh. very like, like not stressful. Like Danielle said, yeah. it was it just, you down. yeah. Like, yeah. Cool. <laughs> very nice. All right. And how about Flounder? Well, I did know that I wanted to play F Flounder because his character has always been one of my favorites, and uh, he does have his own solo in a song in the show. I was stressed out about auditions, but it felt a lot better once I got there and saw all of my friends. Yeah. Listen, it seems to me that it's very clear that Sola is doing a great job of doing really good productions, oh, yeah. but it's doing an even better job of bringing out the best mm -hmm. in some of the people with the arts here in our area. That's just really, really cool. Yeah. So a credit to them. Thank you guys for joining Thank me today. So I really appreciate us. that. Yeah. I can't wait to see you guys on stage. Thank you. This is going to be fantastic. Thank so you. very glad to have you, Danielle, Emma, and Lark, as we look forward to The Little Mermaid, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, the 19th, 20th, 
25th and 21st at Terrebonne High School. Very cheap tickets. Go and get yours today. You certainly don't want to miss this show. Thank you, ladies. I appreciate Thank you it. So much. All right, guys, that'll do it for this particular segment and this Bayou Time. But don't go anywhere. A lot more programming right here on HTV. Today's social media segment is brought to you by Alford and Associates for all of your insurance needs. CIS, Cardiovascular Institute of the South, the highest quality cardiovascular care available. Barker Honda, the Barker family tradition of quality.